Hey, what is up guys? Mr. The Reverts here, and you may or may not have thought that I'd be uploading a Fortnite video onto the channel because I'm mainly a Call of Duty YouTube channel, and that's what I've been known for by the tiny little community of amazing subscribers that I have that support me, but this will probably be the only Fortnite video I upload, so if you're watching this, I'm sorry, but like I've said before on the channel, I will always, always, always be a Call of Duty YouTube channel until the very end, but I want to talk about Fortnite because not too many of you guys are aware that I do play the game I'm a decent player I feel and yeah I really do like the game a lot and there's a lot of players especially in the Call of Duty community that have switched over to Fortnite because of how great of a game it really is and of course the views and monetization is there but in general the game is pretty solid for being a free downloadable game but over the past few weeks I've really been thinking long and hard about this and I've seen quite a few discussions on the topic and it's about Fortnite being the apparent long-awaited COD killer because almost all of the main COD channels like Chaos, Team Martin Drifter, they've kind of taken a backseat and rode the Fortnite train. Now granted, here and there, these guys will upload a, t a few COD videos once in a while, but for the most part, a lot of YouTubers have switched over to Fortnite, and I can kind of see why, because compared to COD, Fortnite is always adding new content such as weapons, updates, and so, so much more. But Call of Duty World War II hasn't really added anything too exciting. Like I really can't think of anything of a new addition to the game that really made me feel super excited and I actually wanted to get on and grind for whatever item that may be. The resistance event was kind of underwhelming if you ask me for a lot of players. The DLC 1 maps don't really captivate a lot of players and to top that off there's a lot of unfinished content and bugs that are still plaguing World War 2 and I don't know just personally I haven't really felt the desire to hop on World War 2 and just grind the game all day long. Maybe when a few more updates come out but just for right now I have not really been having a fun time on uh, Call of Duty World War 2 I've been playing a lot of other games and doing a lot of other in real life stuff but the next Call of Duty game is set to come out very very soon here like around the end of this month or sometime next month is when we should start seeing teasers for it and if they really want to bring back players and heck even add a bunch of new players they should really look into making a battle royale game mode for a COD because even if you just open your YouTube sub box like I said so many people have switched over to posting Fortnite videos PUBG videos all of these battle royale modes and that is is what's hot right now I definitely could see COD jumping on that bandwagon for sure and making their own battle royale game because that market is super super hot right now uh, we've saw them jump on the loot box train before we saw them come out with futuristic CODs when Titanfall was gaining a lot of traction so it really wouldn't surprise me if there will be a battle royale mode that comes out with Treyarch's next Call of Duty game this year but man I really haven't seen a game take this much of a fan base from all across the gaming industry into one single game like it really does amaze me how well of a game uh, Fortnite is and just how well Epic is handing the game uh, it really does surprise me it really is cool to see and uh, hopefully Treyarch will you know kind of take the little bits and pieces from uh, from Epic Games and, and their Battle Royale mode and maybe make their own little one I think that would be pretty sick and I don't know we'll hopefully could see a new rise in the Call of Duty scene with this uh, Battle Royale mode if there were to be one for Treyarch's next game but back to the topic is Call of Duty dead? I'm sorry, I know there's some pretty big hate for COD, but no, the series is nowhere near dead. Has it lost a lot of players? Yeah, sure, but still, whenever a new game comes out, sales are always through the roof, and just every year, there still are a substantial amount of players that hop on, and I feel that if Treyarch comes out with Black Ops 4, instantly that game is going to make a ton of money because it has Black Ops in the title, and depending on how they market the game, and if Treyarch plays their cards right, it could be another successful year, so yeah, COD is nowhere near dead guys and I think it's important for us to appreciate how well the game has been standing after so many years so guys that's it for the video let me know your thoughts about this down below in the comments also drop a like if y'all did enjoy and thank you for watching until next time I'll see you later